There was nothing to hold Marion Davies at San Simeon anymore. She wasn't married and was now, in her own right, wealthy enough to get along with ease. As creditors closed in, she sold jewelry and real estate and gathered a million dollars in cash. Then she turned it all over to Hearst. I started out a gold digger, she said, but I fell in love with him. There had always been unfair whispers about Marion, that she was a floozy without much talent. But it was Citizen Kane that would brand her forever. What about me? I'm the one that's got to do the singing. I'm the one that gets the raspberries. Why don't you let me alone? My reasons satisfy me, Susan. You seem unable to understand them. I thought we were very unfair to Marion Davies because we had somebody very different in the place of Marion Davies. And it seemed to me to be something of a dirty trick and does still strike me as being something of a dirty trick, what we did to her. And I anticipated the trouble from Hearst for that reason. 